With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, so the question is, a rod of mass m kg and length l meter is bent in the form of equilateral triangle as shown in figure. The moment of inertia of the triangle about a vertical axis perpendicular to the plane of the triangle and passing through the center in units of kg meter square is. So for this, let's look at the solution. Okay, so first of all, uh, here what we have to find that is the moment of inertia of the triangle about the vertical axis perpendicular to the plane of triangle and passing through its center that is this point O. Okay. Now it is given that a rod of capital, uh, length L is bent in the form of equilateral triangle. That means uh, here I can say that the length of one side of the triangle will be L by 3. Okay. And similarly the mass will be of M by 3 for one side of the equilateral triangle okay now let's say from this point o to this means this much distance is x okay and if we talk about this half of this full length of one side of triangle so as this full length of the one side of triangle is well by 3 so this much length okay i'm talking about this much length will become L divided by 6. Half of this L by 3 that is L by 6. Okay. Now, to find the moment of inertia for this complete triangle. First of all, we will try to find the moment of inertia for one side of the triangle about this point O. Because it is given that this is an equilateral triangle. Okay, that means all the sides will be equal. So, if we find the moment of inertia for one side about this point O and then if we multiply this by theory so that we get the moment of inertia for the whole system. Okay, so that's why first of all we will try to find for only one segment. Okay, moment of inertia for the one segment about the axis that is I1 can be given by the formula that is mass m divided by 3 into length square that is l divided by 3 that bracket is square into 1 divided by 12 plus mass that is m divided by 3 into x square. Now first of all we need to find here the value of x for this we know that in equilateral triangle this much angle is 60 degree that's why this angle will become 30 degree. Okay, so if we use here the trigonometric that is tan of 30 will be is equals to uh, x divided by L by 6. So from here value of x will become is equals to tan 30 is 1 by under root 3. So it will become L divided by 6 under root of 3. Now if you substitute the value of x here, okay, in our equation. So moment of inertia that is I1 will become is equals to m divided by now this will be 3 square that is 9, 9, 3 is a 27 and 27 multiply by 12. Okay, 27 multiply by 12 will be here and here it will be L square plus M divided by 3 will be as it is in the place of X. We will use this one that is L square divided by 6 square that is 36 and our 3 square will be 3. Okay. So, after multiplying these two, we get ML square divided by 324 plus this will be ML square divided by 324. Okay. So, after taking common as denominator, okay, it will become 2 ML square that will be is equals to ML square divided by 162. Okay, now this is what the moment of inertia for this single segment that we have got. Okay, so to find the moment of inertia for the whole system about this axis, about this vertical axis, 
so we have to multiply it by 3 ok so here the required answer that is moment of inertia for the whole system will be is equals to 3 multiplied by i1 that is 3 into ml square divided by 162 so this will become ml square divided by 54 okay so the moment of inertia for the given rod about the vertical axis perpendicular to the plane of the triangle and passing through the center in kg meter square we got here as ml square divided by 54 okay so, and this is what the, our uh, required answer so according to this if we check the given option so option second will become correct answer for this question so this is the required solution i hope you understand the solution and you will definitely like the solution thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today